Linux Mint has earned its reputation by combining Ubuntu's robust LTS base with a user-focused desktop experience. With the upcoming 22.2 Zera, the project continues this philosophy, introducing visual and theming enhancements without disrupting the familiar workflow users love. Let's first start with the code names and base releases. Linux Mint 22.2 will be called as Zera, named in Clement Lefebvre tradition of female names. Zera is slated for release in June or July 2025 and remains based on Ubuntu 24.04 LTS, which is Noble Numbet. LMDE 7, which is called as GG, the Debian edition continues independently on Ubuntu, deriving from Debian 13 and targeting a June 2025 release. Now let's talk about the visual refresh, which is Mint Y theme updates. Blue tinted grays. Motivation. Pure gray can feel neutral. By adding blue, the UI reads as cooler and more modern, aligning with current design trends that favor subtle color accents. Implementation. The Mint Y theme's grays have been nugged towards a bluish undertone, improving contrast and lending a softer appearance, particularly in dark mode. Now, consistency across editions. These tweaks apply uniformly to Cinnamon, Matte and XFCE editions, ensuring theme harmony across Mint's three flagship desktops. Now, enhanced theming for Flatpak or LibAdvita apps. Accent color support in XTG Desktop Portal X app. Let's start with the new features. Mint's XTG Desktop Portal X app now conveys the user's chosen GTK accent color into LibAdvita based Flatpak applications, letting app controls, sliders, and buttons reflect your theme's accent. Scope works across all desktop editions, which is Cinnamon, Matte, XFCE, bridging the theme gap between GTK3 themes and GTK4 LibAdvita in Flatpaks. Now, LibAdvita Stylesheet Integration Mintex theme adds LibAdvita Stylesheet support to the classic Mintex theme.